and humid day here in Ohio, and this is my 2020 KTM Freeride EXC. Yeah, I've had this bike four and a half years. That's like a record for me. It's the electric Freeride. It's got about 120 hours, 1,800 miles on it. I've put one rear tire on it, one chain, changed the oil once. It's due again. I think it's 120 cc's in there. Uh, you do it every 50 hours or so. But otherwise, it's all stock. It is a fun machine. I just love this thing. It quiet, electric, torque. It's got a uh, it's got a, a battery you can actually remove if you want. You just you just pop up the seat. Batteries here. You could actually do a quick change on it, but I don't need that. It's got plenty of range for what I do. And I'm going to take it for a little spin, and we'll talk about it while I'm riding it. So I'm in map three right now, and that is the most powerful. But it has map one, which is like 50%. So you can teach anybody, beginners, anybody how to ride this bike. It's so easy. Just throttle in brakes. The other thing is, it's electric, so there's, you know, no noise, no heat, no nothing to burn yourself on or get hot. And the the agility of it, since there's very few rotating parts, just a little motor, is honestly is insane. And I have done lots of back-to-backs on this loop here, and this bike will match any of my gas bikes completely with DOT approved trials tires and only I don't know whatever nine inches of suspension travel this thing will match it all my fancy bikes pro component suspension and everything 300s 350s doesn't matter the free ride always comes through and it's it's just fun the other thing that's neat is when you're in the woods, this is all silent. So all you hear is the bike. No foot brake. I can practice my proper Jet Warrant style. Standing up on the foot pegs, pivoting at my hips. Unlocking my hips, Ryan Hughes would be proud. I haven't ridden this thing back here for, for a bit. I forgot how much fun it was. Just tossable. I think these things, I've seen them on sale at KTM dealers pretty cheap. But like cheaper than an electric mountain bike. Oh, it's just fun to play on. That quickness of it. So easy. Instant torque. I think they're only 24 horsepower. 31 foot pounds of torque, so almost as much as a 450. So it will get up and go. Instant wheelies. I think there's a little side trail down here. I want to try. I can find it. Yeah, right here. So you can do that kind of fun, quick trail. Then you can do this exploring stuff. Out in the woods. Totally quiet. This is so cool. Look at that. I know on GoPro it doesn't look like much. It's a vertical straight up. I've seen some of my Enduro buddies come and climb that thing. They're nuts. I'm not going to do it. Now this bike has trials tires. So it's, it's very, they're very useful. 
I've even got it plated here in Ohio so I can take it for little street rides between the trails. But I think a lot of guys that are more serious on it, they'll put some knobbies on it. I kind of like having the trials tires for when I'm on the street or dry hard pack. Suspension is wood soft, really soft. That makes it so comfortable. Makes me wonder why some of my performance off-road bikes have to be so darn stiff. Stealthy, sneaking around in the woods. And then just instant acceleration. Yeah, these things. KTM Freeride EXC. It's quiet. It's got a horn. <laughs> Virtually maintenance free. I've had the bike four and a half years. Like I said, a tire, there's nothing to do. You just wash it, lube the chain, charge the battery. Pretty easy. Man, I like this bike. Four and a half years. It's like a record for me. Two big thumbs up. KTM Freeride EXC.